How's the first few weeks been? It seems like there's not really too much. Nobody's role has been defined yet. Uh, what's the next four weeks going to be like? Uh, well, we start practice Friday. Um, just everybody, I don't think it's a role. We ha anybody has a specific role. I think we all just have to come out and play hard and just get after it. So I don't think there's no specific role with anybody. What's the only role I think uh, anybody has on the team is Nick just has to be a leader, continue to be a leader, and we, we should be fine. Any way to compare this media day to last year's media day? I mean, there was, you had Lute Olsen, you had, you know, it, it seems like it was five years ago that happened. Right. Oh, man. It, it was crazy because this time, last year, it was the day after, a couple days after he was done for. So, yeah. I mean, it's... There, I mean, it's, it's a totally different feeling because also last year I had no clue what I was getting into, you know. I didn't know what that year was going to be like. I had no clue. But this year, you know, I'm, I'm ready. Yeah, probably had some doubts going in what's, what's happening. Happen. Also, I also had high expectations that I didn't, you know, fulfill. And it humbled me. It humbled me a lot. So uh, I, I know what to do now. What do you uh, expect your role to be this year? I mean, obviously this is a small team that could go real guard heavy at times. Mm -hmm. Do you see your role being more like pretty important now that you know, yeah. you're one of the few big guys? Yeah, I mean, obviously, I mean, me and Krill are going to be playing a lot. I mean, I mean hopefully, I don't, it depends on what Miller wants, but. You were one of uh, Pennell's guys that just kept improving game by game, no matter how big the game was. Uh, how do you bring that mentality in this year and teach the other freshmen how to do that uh yeah um thanks just got a got a good opportunity last year to play and like these freshmen are going to get the same opportunities and like i think i feel like they're more skilled than i was last year so i think they're going to contribute a lot and you know as for me i'm just going to try to keep going out there and getting better and better every game like i did last year you know just keep working hard what's it what's it what's it like being you know the majority of the newcomers it's it it definitely makes you feel like more at home because they're all experiencing the same things that I'm experiencing for the first time. So it's just a good experience and I'm just having a good time doing it with everybody. We're, I have a feeling we're all going to be impact players and that's what we came here to do. Coach Miller brought us in and I have a feeling we're going to play a lot. Has anyone taken you under their wing as a uh, upperclassman? I'll, I'll have to say Jamel. Yeah. He's, Seems to be the popular gonna, answer. Yeah, he's, he, <laughs> he's, that's, we, we play basically the same spot and he's just taking me what he went through just making me a lot better from his experience. Who are the freshmen have really caught your eye so far early on? Um, really all of them are great, but I, the most improved so far, I think, is, is Kirill's improved greatly. And then Derek and Momo are both just, you know, they, they just get after it. Momo's just competitive, you know. KP, he's, he's been improving a lot, too, with the practices. You know, he's handling them real well. What's the camaraderie been like? I said, Jamel said that uh, he relates to the freshmen a lot more than he's ever in his uh, time here. So you guys seem to have a, a, a solid chemistry coming in. Yeah, we. I think we had a chemistry from day one, because uh, you know, I mean, we, I don't think by I think by January we won't be looked at as freshmen anymore. We're just gonna be looked at as just basketball players. Definitely. So that's why you know, Jamel had made that statement because you know we we just basketball players. They won't look at uh, look at us as freshmen anymore come January. Jamel said he's really connected with the freshmen more like than ever before. Is there a better, uh, as in camaraderie? You, you find that this uh, team camaraderie is pretty strong so far going in? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I think as you get older, uh, as far as Jamel, you know, his spot, you like you kind of have to become a leader, you know, and uh, you have you have to be able to, to tell the freshmen, you know, what the deal is and, and how to be a captain. So How's uh, Nick Ben, has he, has he kind of embraced like a leadership role? Um, has he been like the go-to guy for this team so far? Yeah, Nick, Nick's really, really stepped yeah, up as leader. Yeah. I mean, he's, he's more, a lot more verbal, you know, pulling guys to the side, you know, teaching them, telling them what to do more, and and he's really improved also. You know, his jump, he barely misses. Like, so. do you know who you're replacing as the walk-on? Uh, David Bagot. That's right. Him. Have you talked to him? I haven't talked to him. No. But I saw the shot against Stanford. Okay. Yeah, so crazy. those are your expectations. <laughs> yeah. You, your senior, you've got to make a, a pretty good it. shot. <laughs> I'll, I'll do my best.